he decided to cut it out. Dave Coulier celebrated two years of sobriety with a photo of when he literally hit rock bottom and smashed his face on stone steps during a drunken night out. I was a drunk. Yes. An alcoholic, the Full House alum, 62, began a lengthy caption for the throwback selfie of his bloodied face on Instagram Thursday. I've been alcohol free since January 1, 2020. Coulier, known for his role as Uncle Joey on the nostalgic sitcom, recalled being the life of the party when he was under the influence. I could make people laugh until they fell down, he wrote. In this picture I was the one who fell down. Not because I was playing hockey or doing the things I love, like shopping wood or doing construction, golfing, fishing or flying airplanes. I was hammered and fell, going up some stairs made of stone. Coulier admitted no one liked beer with the boys more than him and that he was often the final final guy in the room after 8 hour drinking binges, which often led to him feeling like a bull of dog mess in the two days that followed. I loved booze, but it didn't love me back, he wrote. I decided to make a decision for my own well-being, my family and for those around me who I love so dearly. The comedian noted that the mental and physical withdrawal of his sobriety journey were big challenges for him, but praised his wife, Melissa Bring, and friends who had already made the journey. The psychological and physical transformation has been amazing, he shared. The sky is more blue, my heart is no longer closed, and I enjoy making people laugh until they fall down more than ever before. Thank you, Melissa for being by my side. I love you, heart. Bring commented, so proud of you. I love you and your strength so much, heart, heart. Fellow Full House alum Candace Cameron Bure added, love you and always proud of you, heart. Other cast members from the hit 80s and 90s series have struggled with similar issues. In May 2009, Jody Sweden, who played lovable Stephanie Tanner, revealed in a tell-all called on Sweetine that she developed an addiction to methadone, cocaine, ecstasy and alcohol. She got sober in 2008 after 15 years of substance abuse. John Stamos, who played Uncle Jesse, was charged with a DUI in 2015 and had to go to rehab as a result. The heartthrob, 58, told Andy Cohen of his stint at the treatment center in 2016, I had to stop this up and down. I was on some medications, antidepressants and that damn Ambien. I'm so happy to be off of that, my memory was starting to get really f up. That was the hardest thing to kick, by the way, 